Hi, yes, I would like the old Walmart grocery app back, please. Thanks. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time stopping by. My name is Jennifer and I got a Walmart grocery haul here for you. Actually, it's a Walmart grocery pickup haul. Yes, let's talk about that. That new Walmart grocery app, <laughs> it ain't it, sis. Y'all, I, I can't do it. I want the old one back. It's hollow if you hear me. It's it's just not cute. <laughs> that thing gave me a headache this morning when I was placing this order, and I'm, I'm just, I'm over it already. So, anyway, we did Walmart grocery pickup. Spent $166, I want to say. I think that was my total. And, um, yeah, we've got a meal plan to share here. If you're new, why don't you go ahead and subscribe while you're thinking about it. Hit all notifications so you don't miss any of my future videos. I share these grocery hauls every single week on my channel. Sunday, 4 o'clock Eastern Standard. So you'll not want to miss those. Also, we've been sharing some lifestyle content, vlogs, um, cooking. You just never know. So anyway, I wouldn't want you to miss it. We're going to get on into this, guys. I'm going to share with you guys the meal plan first, and then we will get into the grocery haul. All right, you guys, if you've been around a while, you'll know that I always start my meal planning out on Saturday every week. We have a wedding. Today's Friday. We have a wedding tomorrow, and like I told you guys last week, Harrison is supposed to be the ring bearer. It's Jeff's cousin that's getting married, and he's the ring bearer in the wedding. I cannot wait to see him in a tux. Oh, my gosh gonna melt my heart I know Sunday we got a lot going on we've got Jeff's other cousin is having a going away party and we'll be doing that around lunchtime so dinner is gonna be light hot dogs and french fries still gotta eat something right and then Monday we have a burger um, place around our town that has a special on Monday night so we're gonna do burgers again because it's just such a great deal it's like six dollar burger baskets and they are amazing you guys so good Tuesday I've got a fall soup collab coming up uh, I think it's on the 22nd, so stay tuned um, because I'm going to be sharing a soup coming up with my girl, um, Southern Farm and Kitchen. She is hosting that collab. Wednesday is going to be chicken, nu chicken nuggets and tater tots. We're going back to <laughs> something easy because we have jiu-jitsu that night. And then my husband has a lot of faith in me, a lot of faith in me. <laughs> He's want me to try to make chicken pad thai. Um, I found a recipe that looks kind of simple. Um, so we shall see. And then as always, Friday nights, we usually go out or go through a drive through somewhere. Alrighty guys, I got Miss Stevie chilling in her bassinet in there. So we're just listening out for her. She's kind of taking a nap right now, but this is the overview of my haul for today. Yes. Welcome. Welcome. Bread. I've got hot dog buns for our hot dogs that we're going to have one night. And then um, our bread, they had to sub it this week. I wasn't able to get the normal large loaf that I usually get. So we got the Sunbeam King Thin. They subbed my sourdough. <laughs> and I've never had this one before, but it looks pretty good. So we got that. And then for fruits and vegetables, we got quite a few things here. So I don't remember ordering this. Um, I don't know what happened, but that app, I'm just, mm, I just, I'm going to have to get used to it. Potatoes. Got potatoes for something. I don't even know what for. Um, <laughs> I've got broccoli here. I don't remember ordering that, but okay. <laughs> and then I've got green onions here. That's going to go in um, part of the chicken pad thai. As y'all know, I'll be the only one eating that, but that's okay. Baby cut carrots. That's for Harrison. He loves carrots and ranch. And then I needed some matchstick carrots for the chicken pad thai as well. Lemon for the chicken pad thai. It called for lemon or lime juice. I got lemons. And then we've got some avocado here for our breakfast avocado toast that we always love to have. We've got some more bananas. You guys, <laughs> the banana saga. I let my bananas go far beyond this time and I had an invasion of gnats. Oh my God. It was so irritating. I just wanted to like, I wanted to poke my eyeballs out because they were getting on my nerves so bad. 
<clears throat> the bananas. Somebody eat the bananas, please, this time. Blueberries, because Hayden really loves, uh, Harrison loves those. And then also went ahead and picked up some grapes this week. Um, I didn't get them last week because I was giving it a break. Um, the people, people around here just were, wasn't really eating them. So we did pop into the store really quick because they said they didn't have no Diet Pepsi, but they did. And hey, Harrison saw this on the clearance. The clearance is like right near the drinks and stuff in our store. So $1.42 for some a big old thing of marshmallows. And he's already said he wants to have a um, bonfire. So we'll see. We may or may not. Got some spicy nacho Doritos back here. Also went ahead and picked up for cereal this week, Cocoa Pebbles. Um, I was trying to find the Cocoa Pebbles with the marshmallows in it. I think it's like a Malto Meal brand that does that. I don't know if Post does that, but anyway, couldn't find it. So we just got Cocoa Pebbles. We ran out of grits this past week, out of extra virgin olive oil. So I went ahead and picked that up. We ran out of our syrup. I really, really like the log cabin. And for some reason or another, I don't know why, but you cannot get a small bottle of log cabin in my store anymore. It has to be the giant jug. So chicken pad thai needed the stir fry rice noodles so i picked those up never cooked them before never had them so y'all wish me luck everybody be thinking about me this week <laughs> this also goes in the chicken pad thai um peanuts this is the only option that i saw it called for unsalted it didn't say anything about dry roasted but i think it'll be fine pretty sure i got a box of onion soup mix that's for that soup that i'm gonna be making and then also I needed a can of the petite diced tomatoes for that recipe as well. Sweet and condensed milk. I'm going to be making a, okay. So if you've been around a while, I'm going to link it in iCards. Butterfinger poke cake. Actually, I make that for a lot of our little get togethers with Jeff's family. But like I said, for Sunday, we're doing Jeff's cousin's going away um, party. She's moving um, to Georgia and she is, she has to be gluten free. Butterfinger cake is her absolute favorite, but she cannot have it the normal way because she has to have gluten-free. So I'm making a gluten-free Hershey poke cake. We're kind of modifying it some. <laughs> anyway, needed sweetened condensed milk for that. I needed some bean sprouts for the chicken pad thai. Chicken pad thai cost me a lot of money this week, apparently. <laughs> and then I wanted some um, chili for my hot dogs that we're going to be making. I'm the only one who eats that here. Some more mac and cheese for Harrison. Um, that's really the only thing I can get him to eat. <laughs> He's so picky. And then they subbed these. I had um, ordered the original goldfli goldfish. <laughs> goldfish. They're cheddar ones and they were out. Breakfast bars. The boys really dig these. They're a quick, easy breakfast in the morning because they're, we're all rushing out the door, but we've got blueberry and mixed berry. I needed caramel syrup for the cake that I'm making, and then obviously we always get Hershey Simply Five for um, our chocolate milk. Look what they had. Now, this wasn't in my order. I got this a couple of days ago, <laughs> but um, and this is like my favorite spice cake mix. They have all of their fall and Halloween type stuff out right now, and you guys, I was just... <sighs> in heaven. Also, I picked up this Funfetti. This is a chocolate cake mixed with colored bits and the frosting that goes with it that has eyeballs. The boys have been like begging me to let them open that and I won't let them. <laughs> Needed some Hershey's chocolate bars for the cake that I'm going to be making. Got some more straw, um, got some more applesauce for the boys. I got strawberry and original, which I believe. Now, I bought one strawberry and two original last week they done went through all of the applesauce i mean why how like i guess i mean they just they loving it but i don't get it i don't like applesauce that much and then i ordered these to put in hayden's lunch this week and then um went ahead and picked up these pringles it's like a 10 pack just to throw in his lunch back here in the back we went ahead and picked up some cheeses i got the extra cheesy ones this time we've never gotten those and then i saw these i've never gotten them before either the peanut butter chocolate chip sunbelt bars we really like these um sunbelt they're nice and um chewy let me know down in the comments if you prefer the chewy or the crunchy granola bars interested I've got Gatorade for Hayden's lunch, and this is the Glacier Cherry um, flavor. We've got the two cases of Diet Pepsi, which they said was unavailable on my order, but I went up in the store. Okay, yes, the 24-pack 
24 count was unavailable, but they did have 12 packs. They could have subbed this for me and saved me a trip into the store, but they didn't. Yeah. Look what's in stores, guys. We've got pumpkin spice rolls. Yummy, yummy. There's only five in here though. I guess they're really big. We've got some chocolate chip cookie dough here for this week because my husband's always like, what you got sweet to eat? Mm, and I usually have to tell him I don't have anything. <laughs> I've got some mild cheddar cheese slices for sandwiches. I've got some of our liver mush for breakfast. And then I've got some more of this fully cooked bacon to put on top of our avocado toast. I got a pound of the organic grass-fed ground beef. That's gonna go in the soup that I'm making. And then I went ahead and picked up a pack of hot dogs for our hot dogs we're eating one night. We've got three gallons of milk back here in the back. Frozen food. I've got one box of garlic Texas toast for one of the meals we're eating this week. And this was a substitution. I had ordered the um, box of deep dish great value pizzas. And I guess they were out. So they gave me three of the DiGiorno personal pan pizzas. Um, mixed Frozen mixed vegetables. I needed that for my soup that I'm making. French toast sticks. If you know, you know. This is a staple around here. Harrison is all the time asking for these and I've even caught him eating them frozen. So gross. What? Kids are gross. <laughs> Got some whipped topping here for the Butterfinger. Well, actually it's Hershey poke cake now. <laughs> and then tater tots. This was a substitution. I had ordered the Great Value brand and they substituted the Orida brand. And then chicken nuggets for Harrison because that's, um, you know, one of the things I can get him to eat. Y'all, <laughs> they did not have my premier protein. Somebody please tell me you've tried these and that they're good because I wasn't able to get, get Premier this week and it made me sad. I had, to, I had to look for these in the store. I don't know. We shall see. I got some Yoohoo for the boys. Hayden has a mini fridge in his room and I like to keep little things in there for him. And um, so I got him the Yoohoo's and then I also got him the small cans of Twist Up there. Got some more Sunny D back here in the back. And then we went ahead and got some more paper towels. And then last but not least, we got some water down here in the floor. I am literally shocked that Stevie is still napping. I'm sure that she'll be waking up at any point in time. She has only been taking like 30 minute naps and it's draining me guys, it's draining me. All right, you guys, that's gonna wrap up today's video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope that I gave you some ideas of things to pick up on your next trip to the grocery store. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you give me a great big old thumbs up down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not done so already. Oh, and I wanted to mention this. I wanted to give a shout out to one of my viewers I actually met today in Walmart, Amber. What's up, girl? It was so nice to meet you. Thank you so much for coming up and saying hi to me. I appreciated that so much. So anyway, all right, you guys, I hope everyone has a wonderful week, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, y'all.